sit at the same table. We don't allow them to have any conversations because there'll be a bloodbath. But at the end of the day, we all have the common goal of making it a better place to live. At the end of the day, that's all we really want. We want money in our pockets. We want to be able to pay our bills. Um, we want to be able to do something with ourselves. I, I came from nothing. Uh, my father worked three jobs. It wasn't until I was about seven years old that my dad actually bought our first car. And he used to ride a motorcycle to three different jobs. So he worked at Fafner Baring in, uh, down in New Britain. Then he worked at TNS. And then he moonlighted as a plumber. And he built himself. You know, he had no education. He got his GED in after he got out of Vietnam. He got his GED. And he was self-built. Never took a business course a day in his life. Decided he was going to start his own business. My mom said, I can run the books. Even though she was a stay-at-home mom forever and never ran books. But learned. Okay? So they taught us, the one thing they taught us was good, strong work ethic. And they taught us that nothing is impossible. And my grandfather, my mom's dad, talked to me one day. I can remember this conversation. I was just about, maybe about 12 years old. And he said to me, he said, I said, why does my dad work so hard? And he says, he works so hard because he wants to give you an opportunity. He wants to give you an opportunity to have more than what you, he had. More opportunity than he could ever have. And that's the whole goal. That's what all of us get together for every single day. And that's why we speak out. And that's why we talk out. Because we're tired of our opportunities being taken away from us. I've been involved. I'm, this is my sixth term in Harlington. So after I'm done with this, I'll be 12 years as first selectman. I sat two years on the board of selectmen. And seven years as the Water Pollution Control Authority chairman. I ran um, the business with my dad for quite some time. Then I went to work for a larger company for a while. And I took a year off because I want to spend a little more time with my kids. Then I went to the town meeting, opened my big fat trap, as my mom would say, and 